Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. Before we start our learning session, let me introduce myself. I am Puan Ikaliana Khalid from Sekolah Kebangsaan Kementah Kuala Lumpur. With me today is Encik Amril Nurman bin Lukman, our sign language interpreter from SKPK Jalan Pil. Okay, let's start our session. We will learn about one of the simple machines called pulley. Make sure you have a pencil and paper with you. Now, do you see pulleys in these pictures? Yes, you will find the first pulley above the cable car. The second pulley can be seen attached to the tip of a crane. The third pulley can be seen tied to a boat. What will you learn in this topic? You will learn about what is pulley, fixed pulley, parts and functions, uses of pulleys, different types of pulleys. Let's watch this video. How does this cable car move? Yes, it moves with the help of pulleys. Pulley is a simple machine which enables load to be lifted easily using lesser force. Now, let's look at parts of a fixed pulley. A fixed pulley consists of a wheel, an axle, a groove, a rope, and a load. A fixed pulley has a wheel with a groove that enables a rope to pass through it. Okay, let's look at the functions of a fixed pulley. This is a crane model. It has a fixed pulley. The fixed pulley on the crane model works when all the components are connected. What are the components? Let's see the first component. It is base. The base can be plastic, metal or wood. The base is a main support for the whole crane model. The second component is a pole. The pole gives height for the pulleys to be above ground. The third component is an arm. The arms connects a pole and a pulley. Next component is a load. The load is an object we wish to lift. The fifth component is pulleys. One pulley will act as a fixed pulley. Another pulley will act as a motor. The sixth component is a rope. The rope enables the load to be lifted towards the fixed pulley. Now, let's see how the fixed pulley works on a crane model. The first picture shows a load before it is lifted. The second picture shows a load while being lifted. The third picture shows 
a load after it is lifted. Let's continue with the uses of pulleys. There are many uses of pulleys in our daily life. A pulley on a flagpole allows a flag to be raised. What will happen if a flagpole does not have a pulley? It will be difficult to get the flag up to the top of flagpole. In places that have no piping, people use a well as an alternative. A pulley is used to draw water from a well. Please look at the two pictures side by side. Which one is easier to lift a bucket of water from a well using a pulley or without using a pulley? A pulley makes lifting of loads easier because a lesser force is needed. Commercial fishermen use chains of pulleys to pull large fishing nets. What will happen if the fishing nets are not pulled using a pulley? Yes, many workers are needed to pull large fishing nets from the sea. A pulley is used to lift heavy objects from a lower to an upper floor. What will happen if the heavy objects are lifted without using a pulley? Yes, correct. Work becomes much slower and many workers are needed. At construction sites, cranes use pulley systems to lift heavy loads. What will happen to the process of constructing a building if pulleys are not used? The process will take a longer time and need more workers. At the port, a pulley on a crane makes it easier to unload a shipping container from a ship to a truck. Let's watch a video on how pulleys work in a port. How does a pulley help to move a heavy container from a ship to a lorry? The pulley on the ship causes moving the heavy container with lesser force. A boat needs pulley to move its sails around. Weight machines have visible pulleys to help lift and lower down weights. Tow truck uses a pulley on the hitch to lift cars. Rock climbers use pulleys to help themselves climbing up steep rocks. Besides fixed pulleys, there are several types of pulleys. 
other than fixed pulleys, there are compound pulleys. A compound pulley is a combination of a fixed pulley and a movable pulley. Another type of pulley is called a movable pulley. A movable pulley is a pulley which is not fixed in position. It is used to lift an object with a smaller effort. Now, let's answer a simple question. First question, what is a pulley? A pulley is a simple machine that makes the lifting of loads easier using a lesser force. Second question, name the parts of a pulley. Groove, wheel, rope, axle. Again, name the parts of a pulley. Groove, wheel, rope, and axle. Third question, explain how the load is lifted. The load can be lifted when the connected rope is pulled through the groove. When the rope is pulled, the wheel turns and the load is lifted upwards. Now, we have come to the end of the chapter. Let's review what we have learned. Let's wrap up. A pulley is a type of simple machine used to lift loads easily. The components for a fixed pulley are groove, wheel, rope, and axle. A pulley works when a rope is pulled through a groove to lift a load. Examples of applications of fixed pulleys in our life are A pulley on a flagpole allows the flag to be raised easily. A pulley is used to draw water from a well. Commercial fishermen use chains of pulleys to pull large fishing nets. A pulley is used to lift heavy objects from a lower to an upper floor. Alhamdulillah, that's all for now. Thank you for watching The Wonders of Pulley. Till we meet again next time, do take care. Bye!